So guys, back from the video, and this is what if Naruto was an Anbu. Part 1. Now, before I start, I'm going to have to explain a few things. Now, I apologize for not making more of Naruto. I was trained by the Sage 6 Paths, Part 3. That will come out tomorrow now. I know it's about yesterday, but come on, just wait. Also, Naruto is going to have the full nine tails, which is why his killing intent is going to be so large. But without further ado, let's get into this. Kakashi's coming back from a mission, and that's when he sees it in an alleyway. The village is ganging up on Naruto as he was about to jump down the bend. But then, Naruto pulls out three kunais as he throws them all in between the villagers as they ricochet across the walls and ricochet across each other. Going through all of the heads, as Naruto says, bullseye, as he appears at the other end, end with all of the kunai in his fingers. As he hides them away, as Kakashi says, impressive. That's when he jumps down as Naruto looks in shock and he says, shit. He was about to throw his kunai, but Kakashi says, Calm down, kid. I simply want to test your abilities. Come. We gotta speak to the third Hokage. <laughs> After hers and his about what Naruto did, he was in shock as he's like, Kikashi, I want to test how well this boy can hold up against your killing intent. If he's already able to kill at this age, then he probably will be able to. That's when Kikashi lets a small bit of a leak. But Naruto wasn't even shook, and that's when he lets out his own. Kakashi looks at Naruto in shock, and he says, No child should have such hatred. How? How? As Naruto says, My hatred for the villagers have built up over the years. Plus, I barely get to kill them, since I usually just run away. As Kakashi says, Impressive. <laughs> Lord Third, I think we should enroll Naruto into the Anbu. I know Minato Sensei wouldn't want that, but it would help him, well, release all of that killing intent that he has inside of him. Bowled up, just waiting to be let loose. As Horizon says, I agree. I was already thinking of it. Naruto, come here about tomorrow at 6 p.m. I'm going to teach you a few jutsus and, well, I'm going to enroll you into the Anbu. Now we skip forward about a year later, as Naruto is seven years old. He just finished his training with Itachi and Chisui. As Chisui says, you know, you should be known as Konoha's razor blade with that move you have. I can't believe you were so fast you were able to grab my Tanto and basically turn into a blade. As Naruto laughs and says, well, I kind of mixed that technique with Erily, so it makes me a bit faster. As Chisui says, that's impressive. Well, as promised, Naruto, we're gonna give you the crow summoning scroll. But it depends on if the crows like you. It's not up to us, as Naruto says. I understand. Naruto appears in a different dimension as he sees the mother crow, as she says. Ah, you must be the boy Shisui and Itachi were telling me about. Interesting. You have a very large killing intent. I can even sense it without you activating it. <laughs> you would play a good role to use the crows. Well, boy, come, we'll sign the contract. Naruto bolts right back up as he says, it worked. As Shisui says, that's quick. Usually you have to try and train to learn how to summon it, but Naruto, try summoning a crow. And that's when Naruto summons 10 of them. As Itachi looks at him in shock and says, as the Hokage said, he's a prodigy. I just wish my brother could become this strong. As Itachi looked down as Shisui says, what's going on? But Naruto already knew what was going on. Itachi had told him. As Itachi says, Shisui, I'm sorry. Naruto will explain it to you later on. But there's many reasons I have to do this. As Shisui says, oh, come on, Itachi. If you don't want to tell me, you don't have to. As he says, it was some, it's something you have to learn eventually. Please, do not hate me for it. Ashisu is truly questioning what Itachi was speaking about. Meanwhile, on the roof of the Uchiha, well, compound, or one of the buildings, Naruto says, you know, Itachi, if you carry this out, I'll despise you. I'll despise you for the rest of your life. I'll hunt you down and make sure you suffer. How could anyone do this to their own clan? I don't care if you were ordered to. If it was me, I would have became a rogue shinobi over 
as Itachi says, Donzo told me he would do it himself if I didn't. I would rather I have to kill my family than some random people. As Naruto says, you realize your father has the Mangekyo Sharingan. Same as Shisui, they're two capable shinobis who could easily beat all of the army that go up against them. Well, I'll be seeing you later. I hope you make the right decision. If you decide to, I'll look after your brother and train him though. So, he'll be in safe hands. As Naruto disappears in a flash. He, arrive, you know, he arrives in Haruzen's office. As he bows down, as Haruzen says, I want you to monitor the locations of Sasuke Uchiha. I need you to make sure he's alive. Danzo, well, he seems a bit fishy. He might try and get Sasuke's eyes too. He only wanted the eyes of the clan, as Naruto says. I understand, my lord. After the massacre, Haruzen was right. But the army wasn't after his eyes. He was trying to get him to join, and that's when Naruto jumps down as he slices off his head. As Naruto sheaths it, as Sasuke looks in fear, as Naruto says, Don't worry. My name's Fox. What's yours? Now we skip forward a few months later. Even though Sasuke was depressed, it was Fox who stopped him from the darkness. Naruto was making sure he looked after Sasuke. Of course, he did want to live with him, but... He couldn't. After all, he couldn't risk revealing his identity. As Sasuke says, Fox, I've known you for a month now. Can you not tell me who you are? As he says, you'll find out in due time. But the result will shock you. I won't be who you expect. Trust me, I'm about the same age as you. As he says, so how are you that powerful? As he says, hmm, family genes. As Sasuke says, yeah, but I'm a Uchiha and I'm not that strong. As Naruto grins, as Naruto says, hey, how about I teach you some techniques? After all, if you want to defeat your brother, you're going to have to get stronger. A few hours after the training, Sasuke's panting, as he still continued. As he says, oh, that was tiring. Naruto grins and says, you prolonged it for a longer time than last time. I'm impressed, Sasuke. Now, try it. As Sasuke says, Fire star, fireball jutsu! As he made the hand signs for it. As he spits out at Naruto, as Naruto says, Good, good. You're learning quickly. And you're only seven years old. As Sasuke says, But you're seven too. Now, we're gonna skip about five years later. Naruto's got a lot stronger. And, well, considering that he's not really in the academy. Well, he's just about to join for the exams, as everyone knows that Naruto is involved with the Hokage, as they pretty much spread the word that the Hokage trains him. But they don't know he's in the Anbu. In fact, no one does. He always wears eye contacts on his missions, as his eyes are pitch black. No glow, no emotion, as it makes him seem even more terrifying than he already is. A 12-year-old, able to kill Jonin's with ease who could slaughter thousands of shinobi across the battlefield. As Naruto's thinking to himself, hmm, I should probably teach Sasuke a new jutsu. It's been a while since I've trained him. That's when Naruto arrives at the Uchiha compound, as he sees Sasuke. Basically searching for the scrolls, he says, yo, as Sasuke is taken aback in shock, he hasn't seen Fox in months, he says, where have you been? As Naruto says, Ah, <sighs> the old man had me doing missions for months. He sent me out for so long I got bored. Of course, I had to complete my mission. Otherwise, what type of army would I be? <laughs> Sasuke says, Anyway, I've learned a few jutsu on my own, as Naruto says, really. What jutsu is? As he says, Well, I learned what my chakra nature is. And Naruto says, And it is? As he says, Fire. Lightning. And it seems I'm good with Earth stuff too. As Naruto says, that's very good, good Sasuke. But I need to see how proficient you are with your new jutsu. As he says, of course. As Naruto gets ready in the arena, as he grins. But what Naruto forgot was his contacts. As Naruto, as Sasuke realized, Fox looked very similar to the Uzumaki boy. It was only trained with. The third Hokage. It can't be him, right? No way it could be. 
as Naruto says, if you manage to lay a scratch on me, I'll reveal to you my identity. Of course, it's a very rare sight I'll do this. As Sasuke grins. Before Naruto could take Gobo, he threw a, shur a shuriken and a kunai. But Naruto was ready for this, as he grabbed them by the rings and reflected them back towards Sasuke. Sasuke was in shock, and that's when Naruto says, Shuriken! Kunai! Release! That's when they split into multiple different shurikens and kunais. Hundreds. As Sasuke says, Firestyle! Great Fireball Jutsu! As he shoots out a great fireball, incinerating them, turning them, well, to dust. As Sasuke didn't buy the most expensive shuriken and kunai, knowing Naruto was able to do this, he knew he would need to be able to incinerate them just in case something like this happened. As Naruto says, good. But you haven't seen my new Jutsus. As Naruto had recently joined Danzo. As Danzo found Naruto to be quite capable. As he even became a lot more dark, but he stayed true to himself. Keeping the emotion, just hiding that fact from Danzo. As he made it seem fake when he was around Sasuke, but Sasuke knew it was genuine. As Naruto says, would stir. With binds. Sasuke can't move as Naruto says, Fire style! Phoenix Fire Jutsu! Sasuke barely breaks free, but he gets hit as he's sent flying as Naruto appears in front of him as he sends him flying up as he says, Water style! Azure Dragon Palm! As Sasuke sent flying even further as he says, Damn it! I can't get a hit on him! He's too quick and well rounded out. That's when Sasuke activates his two term sharing gun. As he rushes towards Naruto with his tanto, as they're clashing, as Naruto says, Good, that sharing gun of yours is working wonders. <laughs> you might even be able to beat a mid tuning. Impressive, Sasuke. You've got a lot better. Your chakra control is definitely of the level of a high Jonin as well. This is what I like to see. But you're too slow. As Sasuke sent into a wall. But Sasuke planned for it. As Naruto put his hand up as he says, Alright, training's over. That's when he feels a slit on his wrist as his guard was down. Naruto looks at Sasuke in shock. He says, Well done. I didn't tell you my identity would shock you though. As Naruto moves his mask to the side, as Sasuke looks at him in shock. As he says, Naruto? You're Fox Sensei? As he says, Just continue calling me Fox Sensei though. It will be awkward if you refer to me. And my actual name. As he says. That's cool. That's what you've been doing with the Hokage. You're an Anbu. As he says. Yeah. And I might become. Well. A Shinobi too. Hopefully I join your squad. Sasuke grins at this. Naruto wasn't expecting this reaction though. For some reason he thought. Well Sasuke would hate him because of this. But. It was the exact opposite. As him and or Sasuke and Naruto were basically like acquaintances. So it just made it even better. The person looking after him was someone he was already chill with. As Naruto says, Well, you've still got a lot to go. Sasuke says, What was that wood style you used? I understand you released it to use that other jutsu though. That's why I was able to break free, but still, what was it? Naruto grins and he says, Well, if you notice, as Naruto pulls out a, a small strand of hair, as it's white, as he says, This is because I have sent you DNA and blood in me. Of course, this was an experiment. I didn't know if it would work or give me, well, the first Hokage's Mokotan, but it did. And now I'm even more powerful than ever. Now we skip to the final exams. Naruto walks into the academy. As Ruka says, oh, I see people think they can waltz in uninvited. That's when. Haruzen's behind him as he says, no, no, I've taught him everything in the academy already. It's fine, Ruka. As he says, oh, yes, Lord Hokage. As Naruto grins, as Ruka says, all right, class, settle down, settle down. Oh, Naruto, since you're the last one in, everyone else has already done their test. They're just waiting for their results. As Naruto says, cool. Do I have to do the written one? As he says, yes, you do. That's when Naruto throws him a sheet. As he says, I did this with the third Hokage. Go and ask him. As Naruto sits next to Sasuke, as they fist bump. And that's when Ruka says, well, Naruto, time for your last exam. 
That's what Naruto says. Multi shadow clone jutsu. All of a sudden, ten shadow clones appear behind him. As he grins and says, Well, this is a lot better than clones. As he starts sparring with one of them. As he uppercuts him. As he smashes him into the wall. Also creating a dent. As Naruto says, Ah, oh, that hurts though. These clones share your ex their experiences with you. So, their pain, well, you can kind of feel it. Or to a certain extent. It was only a small amount for me though. As Uruki says, Alright Naruto, transformation jutsu. And then I want to see your shuriken skills. In fact, since you're late. No, that's not, that's fine. I just need to see your shuriken shows and your transformation jutsu. And that's what Naruto says. Transformation jutsu. As he transforms into the fourth Hokage? Why him of all people? They understand that the fourth Hokage saved the village, but there were many other cooler Kages, which is what some of the villagers fought. I mean, no, some of the, um, the children fought. As Naruto says, you wanted to see my kunais? Alright then. As they go outside, as all of a sudden, ten appear in Naruto's hands. As Ruka says, nice magic trick, Naruto, but seriously. That's when Naruto flips around. As he flicks them all at one point. That's when they start hitting off each other. As they all hit into the same target, breaking through each and every one of them. Eruka looks at Naruto in shock. As none dropped. How could a, a child who's not even again in do this? Something doesn't add up. The third Hokage taught him a lot more than he should have. Well, he'll get to the bottom of it. After school, Naruto had he passed and their teams got called out and Naruto's happy he was on the team with Sasuke. While Naruto's walking home, one of Danzo's arm will appear behind him as he says, Lord Hokage wants you in the office. As Naruto says, and why isn't one of Hiruzen's arm telling me this? As he says, I don't know, but he sent me. Naruto body flickers in as Hiruzen says, Naruto. Someone has stro stolen the scroll of the ceiling and I need you to retrieve it. As Naruto says, yes sir. As he body flickers away after equipping his ambu gear, he takes his sword as he un as he takes out his kunai too. He's tracing them as he senses an off chakra. Something hyper and excited. And no, this isn't something of a child. This is something of a tuning. He understands. It's one of Konoha Shinobi doing this. Someone betrayed the village. As he instantly, well, body flickers back to Hiruzen and he says, It's a Konoha Shinobi. I could sense that chakra. As he says, I see. And who is it? As he says, It's Mizuki. He was one of the teachers in the academy. I may have sensed it briefly today, but I already know what his chakra is. That's when Naruto rushes towards it. As he finds Mizuki, as Mizuki grins and he says, Well, you must be the Nine Tails brat, huh? Well, demon, I'm gonna tell you. Truth is, the fourth Hokage sealed the Nine Tails inside of you. As Naruto laughs and he says, I know. That's when he starts rotating as he slashes Mizuki's arms off. As Mizuki streams out in pain. That's when Naruto says, What a style. No, that's a waste of my talents. As he grins, as he says, I'm going to torture you. That's when Kakashi appears, as he sees Naruto continuously stabbing Mizuki. As Aruka also appeared, as he was in shock, he saw Naruto enjoying himself. As he wanted to do something, but Kakashi says, no. He's laying out his anger. Do you want him to do one of the villagers? As Aruka says, no, I don't, but I didn't know Naruto was in the Anbu. As he says, he is. I was to release his anger. That's the whole reason he's in it. And that's what he's doing right now. As Naruto stomps Mizuki out. As his brains scatter everywhere. As he says, Well, Kakashi, I got all the information I needed. He was working for Orochimaru. As he was trying to deliver the scroll to him. He also grabbed the scroll with a lot of information. Trying to juke me out. As Ruka says, Naruto, you're an Anbu? As he says, yeah, I don't know how it wasn't obvious. Maybe the villagers and people in this village are dumb. <sighs> well, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna give, well, the third the scroll back. 
As Kakashi says, Naruto, get back here right now. You're gonna clean up your. That's when Naruto disappears. As Kakashi says, I'm going to have a word with that boy later on. As Kakashi was kind of like his caretaker, as he basically looked after Naruto. As Naruto appears in the Uchiha compound, as he says, Yo, Sasuke, take a few of these jutsus. And he says, Huh? What are. That's the scroll of sealing? Who stole it? Did you, as Naruto says, No, I was sent to retrieve it. I've already got it. It was Mizuki Sensei. As Sasuke stops, he says, Mizuki? He did that. As Naruto says, Yeah, surprisingly. I don't know how the Hokage's god didn't manage to catch him. Maybe the Hokage needs to increase security. That shows any random shinobi could just come in and steal it. Even I could. But here you go. Here's a few more well, jutsus on some scrolls. I'm gonna come back later. See how your progress is doing. After all, we are on the same team. Anyway, see you tomorrow. Oh yeah, they already spoke to Kashi on the roof and they already said their dreams. As Naruto's dream is uh, to make the fourth and third Hokage proud. Also to become the strongest shinobi in existence. As he skips to the next day. As Kakashi's ringing the bells, as he says, Alright team, I wanna test your strengths. As Naruto basically shows a message to make Sasuke move away. As Hikashi says, Oh, I know he trained Sasuke, and Sasuke knows who he is. So it's not like they won't work together, but what's Naruto trying to do? As he says, Well, Kakashi. I've been wanting to test my new jutsus on you. As Kakashi says, Alright, Naruto, let's. That's when he hears. Woods thou! Deep forest emergence! All of a sudden, trees race from the ground. As Kakashi and Naruto are taken high up, even higher than the other ones. As the villagers look at the trees in shock, where did they come from? As Danzo thinks he's dragging too much attention to himself. Well, it doesn't matter. It's a restricted area. And that's what Naruto says. You know, Kakashi, your abilities are very interesting. In fact, I've studied you. I understand how you can use the Raikiri and all that. But what you don't know about me is I'm a very capable shinobi. The Nine Tails can also enhance my vision. As Naruto puts his hand down, as he says, Chidori! As, he ru- as his eyes turn red with slits in them, as he rushes towards Kakashi. Kakashi was in shock and he says, impressive. After Maduro, as he jumps up, knowing this would barely hold, as he breaks through it, as he says, <laughs> impressive Kakashi, just as I expected from you, but not impressive enough. As Naruto says, five star flamethrower, as a large flame appears. As Kakashi's in shock, how could Naruto output something this large? He knew he had a large amount of chakra, but the chakra control needed to do this would at least be to the level of a kage. As Naruto says, Fire style flame bullet! As Naruto's continuously spamming Jutsu, and that's why, as he says, Fine then. All of a sudden, Naruto's blade ignites. As he pulls out a taunter, as that ignites too, and that's when he starts to spin. As Kakashi's impressed. As he says, so that's why they call him Naruto, Konoha's ruthless razor blade. As Naruto spins towards Kakashi, who, well, gets hit, as he's a slash mark across his chest. As Naruto says, interesting, I simply wanted to test your ability. As he puts his hand down on the bushes, as well, they shrink down. That's when Sasuke says, Fire style, great fireball jutsu. As Kakashi shocked, he didn't expect this. As multiple shuriken flew towards Kakashi. As Naruto in front of him poofed. That's when the shuriken transform into Naruto clones and the real Naruto. As he says, Rasengan! The Rasengan forms in his hand. As Kakashi says, Your pass. As he didn't expect Naruto to hit him, but he does in the stomach. As Kakashi says, Ow! Why did you do that? As Naruto says, you can't get out of this now, Kakashi. After all, you are fighting up on air. He says, I see you guys' teamwork's very impressive. I would like to see more teamwork from you. Well, and next time. Now, we skip forward about a month later. 
As Naruto's bored of these boring missions. He's an Anbu. He should be going on s rank missions right now. But Haruzen forced him to be on a stupid Genin sword. As, well, Haruzen says, Today, because you guys have, well, got the mark, I'm going to give you a c rank mission. As Naruto says, Finally. As he says, This mission, well, Another squad was sent out, Team Asuma, but they were ambushed by, well, Joni, Kakashi, and his team. We're going to need you guys to help that team and basically be their backup, as Naruto says. And what do you think a bunch of Genins are going to do, as he says, Naruto, you know I've trained you. You're the most powerful Genin right now. In fact, you're the most powerful Genin in existence. No one has ever been stronger as a Genin than you. Not even me, the fourth Hokage, Itachi Uchiha, or... And that's when you see Sasuke has a dark look in his eyes. As Naruto says, calm down, man. You shouldn't be mad at every mention of his name. Otherwise, I'll make you, well, go brash. Sakura says, get your hands off Sasuke. That's when Sasuke says, shut up, Sakura. As she's shocked. As Naruto says, see, power your rage on people like her. She's annoying. As, well, Naruto's squad walk out, but Naruto body flickers. As he's waiting for the Konoha's gates. Now we skip forward to when they're at his house. Asuma Shikamaru. Ino and Choji. As Naruto says, Nice to see you guys again, as he grins. Shikamaru always felt something about Naruto was off. Not in a bad way, but like his strength wise. He was always above everyone else, and Shikamaru knew this. It didn't matter if you were Nuchiha or anything like that. Naruto had a dangerous presence around him. As Sasuke says, Hey Naruto, can we go over those jutsus again? As Naruto says, be quiet. As he says, oh, oh, I forgot. As Kakashi starts to laugh, knowing what Naruto's referring to. Same as Sasuke. As he says, you two go, learn your jutsus. As Shikamaru, well, this gave Shikamaru even more proof of speculation. As Naruto's thinking, right then, what should we go over today? After the training session, they come back inside only to eat food. As everyone's sitting down happily. And that's when Neri shouts, You're all wasting your lives! Why? Why'd you come from your lush, lavish homes? With no issues, no suffering, and come here thinking you can be saviors? It doesn't matter how many people you have, no one can beat Gato. As Naruto starts to laugh, as Neri says, What are you laughing about? And that's when Naruto says, Shut the fuck up. As he emanates on killing it, as he says, You think I haven't suffered? You think I haven't suffered? Oh, kids these days, they need to learn. You should have respect for your elders. As Neri says, You're only 12 years old, I don't know why you're talking. As Naruto says, Do you want me to carve your tongue? As Sakura tries to slap Naruto, but he catches it. As he says, I'm asking you the question. If people like us didn't come here, you, your mother, your grandpa would all be dead. Do you want that to happen? Hmm? Well, do you? I bet you they'd rape your mother and then sell her as a sex slave. Oh, not to mention, you're a kid. You could probably be sold as a slave too. Your grandpa, well, got to put a high bounty on his head. I could kill him right now and take it if I wanted to. As Tazan looks at Naruto in fear, as he says, but that's why I'm here, to protect your grandpa. You know, you're foolish. As Naruto ruffles up Ineri's hair, he says, You can't solve all of your problems on your own. That's something I've understood for a while. I used to be like you, brash, angry, and well, I've rushed to different conclusions, but I learn, and I think you can too. As Ineri says, I'm sorry. As he was shocked at Naruto's reaction after. Now, we're gonna skip to when they're going to the forest. 
as Naruto and Sasuke both wake up late, as they were left to our guard and Neri and his mother. That's when they hear some screams as they walk outside, seeing them, about to have their heads sliced off. That's when Naruto begins to spin like a razor blade, as he slashes both of their heads off, as if it was nothing. As he shifts his sword, as he says, Sasuke, we need to go. As Sasuke says, right, as they, bucky, as they body flicker away, as he says, well, right there, Shikamaru and Choji are in that circle. Sakura and Ino are defending the bridge builder, and Kakashi and Asuma are fighting Zabuza. Sasuke, go in there, I'll back you up later. Right now, I'm gonna help, well, Asuma and Kakashi. As Asuma was really damaged, but he could fight to the level of like a low journey, you know, while Kakashi was to his full standard. That's when Naruto rushes in, as he says, those guys are up goodbye, Kakashi. I'm assuming I'll be able to use my jutsus, as he says, go ahead, and that's when Naruto says, wood star wood binds, as Zabuza can't move, Haku's in shock, and that's when Kakashi says, Chidori, as he stabs it through his chest, Zabuza drops to the ground, as Haku says, Zabuza, as he rushes towards him, as he tries to kill Naruto, but Naruto simply ignites his blade as he slashes Haku's head off. As Naruto grins, as he continues to slash across Haku's body, as he sheaths his sword, not wiping the blood out. He always cleaned the sheath, but he didn't clean his sword for some reason. Even Danzo didn't understand why, but Naruto did this to, well, not go too far into darkness. This reminded him of the amount of people he killed. It reminded him that he's committed sins that could be unforgivable, and he doesn't want to go into a higher level of darkness. As Naruto says, Well, let's go. As Tatsuna says, What's your name, boy? As Naruto says, My name's Naruto. Why? As Tatsuna shouts, This bridge shall be named the Great Naruto Bridge. As that's when Gato comes up. As Naruto grins. And says, Kakashi, can I kill them? As he says, sure thing, have a run day. As Asuma says, I know he helped us beat Jonin, but Kakashi, you killed him. There's no way he can. As he says, Asuma, don't worry, the kids got this. <laughs> That's when Naruto says, this is going to be a lot of fun. Lightning style, lightning bolt, as he slams his hand down onto the ground. And that's when multiple bolts of lightning stab into all of Gato's troops. As they all drop to the ground, smoke coming out of their mouths. As Naruto just hit them with over 150 million volts. Enough to kill a human, well, a lot of times over. As Naruto grins. That's when... Sasuke thinks, Naruto, how about we imprison him instead of you killing him? As Naruto says, yeah. As he looks at Tosin, he says, it's up to you. Do I kill him or you imprison him? As he says, well, as everyone on the bridge says, let's imprison him and torture him. Make sure he suffers, but we won't make sure he dies. Now, we arrive back in Konoha. Shikamaru and Choji. Well, they arrive. They see Naruto and Sasuke training. As Naruto says, AGAIN! As Sasuke says, GREAT FIREBALL JUTSU! As Naruto says, AGAIN! But even more powerful this time! As Naruto looks behind. But Shikamaru and Choji were hiding and he says, Come out, I could sense you coming. As Shikamaru says, So, I was right about assuming. You're above every other Genin. As Naruto says, Yeah, you're right about that. That's when Nambu appears, and he says, Lord Hokage has requested you to his office. As Naruto says, go ahead. As he disappears in a blur. This is part one, I hope you enjoyed, and bye.